absolutely fabulous day. We've had a great turnout, lots of celebs, lots of very happy punters, um, fantastic surroundings. Uh, lots of the public have come in the afternoon, the sun's come out, and I think everybody's really enjoyed themselves. Fairbridges is, is quite a little known charity because it, it works very holistically with young people so we're very careful about how we market and brand um, the organisation so things like this are the way in which we explain the work that we do to the general public really in closed events like this um, and it also acts as a fundraising event um, and I think we've done really well today actually. Fairbridges isn't a job, it's a way of life and it's events like this that actually make the magic happen for the young people who have very little opportunity within their own lives. How's it been today? It's been absolutely uh, wonderful today. We had great, great fun. It's a fantastic turnout and uh, hopefully we're going to raise lots of money at the auction that hasn't started yet, but I've really enjoyed it. Yeah? Yeah. It was a Fairbridge event two years ago and I didn't really know what Fairbridge was all about then. I just played in the game. but. Since then I've become an ambassador and, and done the awards and things like that, so it just has a little more poignancy this time. Although a charity like Fairbridge gets uh, donations from institutions and the government, the local government, most of the money they get through that scene, I mean West Midlands needs 600,000 uh, a year, um, usually have some sort of uh, handle on them. You know, they are, they are geared to having to use it uh, in certain ways. Money is raised in this way, which is event organising, have no strengths. So they're able to do things with the money they get out of something like this that they can't do with the other funds that are raised. Uh, yeah, I mean, any cricket charity game is usually a lovely event because uh, so I love the game of cricket and the people you meet around cricket are all good people, you know, so it's an absolute delight to be involved, it really is. So it's a marvellous charity and I'm delighted to help in a small way, you know. Okay. So I've been at Fairbridge for over two years now. Um, first time I started Fairbridge I was like less confident, shy, um, I was in a hostel from the beginning, so it was their move put me into Fairbridge and Fairbridge helped me with my confidence and helped me bring up my confidence and then I found out that they were doing a horse project course, so I thought I'd apply for that to see, because I was a bit scared around big animals and horses and that. But, um, so I went to an induction and I got like really, oh wow, I was scared at first. Then I've like built up my trust with the horse and stuff. So now I've been like, going to Kingdom Horse for uh, about two years now. So I approached Claire and asked her if she had ever used horses as a medium. And she said no she hadn't, but she would like to. And then I went home, thought it was the champagne that I'd, I said, I don't know what I've done, but I've gone off with them. Kingdom Horse is a, um, a provider. And um, uh, yes, so they came back and that's how it started. We had our first group of people, it's nearly two years ago now, of young people. And, um, and it's just grown from there. The youth, it, they're responding on their emotions and their feelings. It's not that they judge them, it doesn't matter what they do, it's not about performance. It's just, where are you right now in this moment and what are you thinking, where's your focus? And it just gives the young people a chance to, to focus on communicating and not being judged by a person. Chris, how's the day been going? Great. I mean, you know, England at its finest, beautiful sunny day, great big crowd turned up. But for me, Fairbridge has been, you know, a really great one to be involved with. So no, dig deep. Chris, Get your hands in your pockets. So it counts. And on a day like this, we hope that people will buy it thousands of raffle tickets and, and bid generously at the auction. And I think Fairbridge looks as if it's on the up, so I'm thrilled to be a part of it. I'm proud to be involved with Fairbridge as well.